Welcome back folks. Namaste. Hope you're all well. Taking care over there in India. Friends and family. This is a little video demonstrating the off-road capabilities of a modified interceptor. If you've not seen any of my other videos or suspension mods etc look back on the Royal Enfield playlist see what you can find. Modified the front forks for off-roading and various other modifications such as a bash guard etc but I'll leave you to look into that so this is at the end of the trail being a successful one obviously I'm still here I haven't dropped it or added any significant damage that I'm aware of but I've not actually looked in detail just moved you a bit closer so you don't get run over so as I was saying very successful test very happy with it trail it's been on it's even makes you bounce around a lot in the Land Rover and can even cross axle the Land Rover so um, very impressed that this got up obviously you can pick your line better on a bike than, than on a 4 before um, but I've been up there on a few bikes now and very impressed very impressed with how it handled I would have thought very much just as well as a decent sized adventure bike maybe even better than a GS who knows I wouldn't want to risk taking a GS up on my own because I'd probably get squashed underneath it so I'll stop wittering and I'll uh, roll the clips let you see how we got on so here we go this is just a gentle beginning see how this goes I'm tackling the track the one that I've been talking about in her upward direction which will be the most challenging um, also it's probably slightly better because ABS is not great for going downhill so we'll see how she goes last time I came here on my own uh, to do this trail was on my old bike on a CRF um, and it was very snowy and icy and I just thought oh I want to get out and have a play solid ice kept dropping the bike got absolutely gassed it was absolutely terrible so I do hope this solo experience is a more successful and less difficult one it must just be the four wheel drives that they don't want this is rather more technical than you'd expect such a bike to get up. I think I could have done with adjusting my levers a little bit to be fair. They're a little bit more upright for off uh, for on road action than I like for off road. But we'll see how we go. At least that first bit's over with, but the worst is yet to come. It's quite loose and rocky this. Clattered then. I can't pick my line like I want. <laughs> Whew. That was a bit tricky. I'm a little bit gassed, even on that little bit. I might go for it's either go up to the left and over to the right or straight up there. Not up there, people shouldn't be going up there. That is what we'll get our lanes closed, that was all nice grass banking, silly people up she goes with confidence right, I've got two fingers on my clutch now, I'm in a bit more control Pretty challenging. <sighs> My forearms are being pumped with this heavy bike and lack of use. Woo! I'm not riding this way, I'm just getting in position to go up the next bit. Woo! <sighs> 
a little bit gassed. I think I might try and take some pictures here. It's quite a good spot. So folks, I hope that technical bit demonstrated to you that these can probably do a lot more than you think. It's a heavy one on your forearms, but she did it. Did it alone, up in one go. Really happy with that. This isn't the this isn't the most technical part here, but uh, I didn't want to stop on the other bit. Right then, folks. First thing I've got to get right setting off is that little drop in. Already blowing already, even though I've had a break. I'm very unfit. Just I think partly the nerves though being off on my own. But beautiful place to be. So let's go. Do that on my recording. Yes. Woo. That bit gone. Always oh, nervous setting off. Need to adjust these levers a little bit. Definitely down. Maybe a bit more in towards the bars. So it's my true do it all bike. This is the test I want to put it through. I've been putting it off a little bit. Very happy. Ooh. So, I think we should be good for most of the common trails in the UK, apart from the more technical stuff. A lot of the places I rode in Wales weren't as bad as that most technical bit back there. All the bits I've rode so far, I'm sure there are lots of tricky bits, but very, very happy with that result. Now some whoops, gravelly sections, see how we do on here. Some walkers on here which I never look forward to meeting because some of them are terribly nasty. Oh, something dingle dangled. I think most of the, the noise, the two noises I've heard whilst out, the dinging, I don't think it was grounding. It's just these bits of rocks probably cracking on the swing arm as they get spun over by the tyres. goes well I'm just going respectfully seeing as I'm coming up to some walkers I don't want them being unnecessarily upset with me Oops, that, there's two sets of walkers Oops, there's some lamtrons as well I hope everybody's keeping the dogs on the lead See if they go back in. <laughs> yeah. Should have brought a sheepdog on back. <laughs> yeah, if I go past them on the right. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully they're more well behaved than my Jacobs. <laughs> Come on, little ones. Joys of spring. Yeah, if you go off to, if you go hard to the right they'll should uh They'll probably go back on their own. Don't have him landing in gully. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> Bit slippery. They look like they might go. I know, yeah. It's when the cat will go through all at the same time. Oh, there's always one. <laughs> it's having difficulty. Must have gone for a small owl. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> I 
đi ạ Thank you Living her up a bit now, shall we? Woo! It's got enough power to just raise the front end a bit. And you're going over some of the. Oh, there you go, you can just lift her over some puddles. So she passes that test. A little bit of a kick up. Particularly if you get a little kicker, you can just pick her up. Very good, very happy that we've passed the test. Oh, I think it's the first time I've caught that. So I hope you enjoyed that little ride. Keep looking back for more, I'm trying to do at least one video a week not on any particular day uh, but just look out hit your subscribe tick your notifications because otherwise you won't get to know when I do some fabulous videos and as I was saying friends and family in India and all over take care keep safe look after yourselves and look after your friends and family and when you do go out ride safe thanks for watching bye bye Aujo